it's hard to explain when I, I wish you could see it for yourself. But you almost, and I'm going to be real with you. If so, like, so this is around or you're around, you ain't going to see it because shit, that's when motherfuckers lock it in. You know what I mean? Oh, you say Soze. And he show up here. Oh my God. What's hey, going on, Soze? How we doing, guys? Pretty good. Just a little I've bit of despairing to over shift one. Running to you guys to see how you've been doing, actually. <laughs> good to see you. Why are you just standing like that, Bass? You look like a fucking Wait. pussy. You ever, oh you, anyone God. ever told you that? Hold on, hold on. Um, you're not is prepared. This bad? Your hands are going to be in front because you're closer to the weapon and you can defend yourself if someone oh, jumps on you. I mean, I mean, this is a mature, mature D route. Mature yeah, D yeah, I, I can do it everywhere, though. I guarantee I'm not you're going to stop. Fucking... I'm not going to have my hands behind uh, my back. Like no, I guarantee. If there's, if there's a woman on the side of the road, you're definitely standing like that, you little pussy. Absolutely not. I okay. like it. I'm done with relationships. That's more like it. That's the best I want to see. I'm ready, buck, buck. All right, well, since you're here, then we can probably um, convey this meeting. And, and uh... I need to ask, did this get posted? <laughs> the fuck are we talking about? Posted? What's happening? It's talking about docket posting. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, but what, what are you posting? What, what's going on the docket? Uh, well, the Simone investigation is uh, now up. It's been up for, I think, about like a week and a half. Good save, um, fine. Good save. Good save. Good Simone's save. been brought into custody by Miguel O'Marion. Uh, we have a... Uh, he's requesting a bail hearing. Uh, I think a it's going to be... A bail hearing? Yep. Tomorrow, 10 a.m. Eastern. And we yet to have a interrogation scheduled, so it's going to be uh, pretty juicy. Isn't this guy a fucking terrorist? Super mm -hmm. terrorist. Also, uh, what yesterday... What the fuck bail is he going to get? I don't think he's going to end up getting bail, like, hopefully... Uh, obviously that's going to be the DOJ's, like, it's well within his rights to request it. Uh, but we're going to make it very clear this motherfucker's a huge flight risk. I mean, he, he had fucking own Russians attacking us. Yeah, yesterday, because he got caught, we're not, I mean, we're not, we're not sure if this is cause and effect, but we were attacked by the Russians. F-14s, jets, missiles, everything. Los Santos was under major attack. However, we prevailed and shot them all down. Three of them died, the Russians. Can we just blow that fucking place up, please? I'm sure there's still all in there. We should, but Lil Moscow... I don't understand. Lil the Mos Russians are fucking invading us with fucking aircraft. I don't know how the fuck they get their airships into our airspace, but I got a feeling we should just blow that shit up. We should just fucking put a bomb in it and blow the fucking thing up. Blow it sky high. Fuck that piece of shit. The fuck is the Senate doing? Bunch of pussies. Any of you guys try to reach out to the Senate about this shit? I have not. Um, I'll reach out to them. I just heard about this today. You're telling me there's terrorists in the city bombing us and shit, and you haven't reached out to the fucking Senate. You guys are fucking stupid. Well, I know I know one senator knew about it uh, a long time ago. He knew about the whole thing back and forth, uh, but I haven't updated the rest of them. I should probably reach out. The attack happened yesterday from the Russians. I technically okay. have uh, authority to run Guantanamo. That was the last thing the Senate told me. Guantanamo, huh? Interesting. Yeah. Unfortunately, I mean, honestly, hmm. I'd just say fucking put them on a on the that spaceship being built up there, sending shores, strap them to the front of it, send them to the fucking moon, leave them up there. Hmm. Yeah, actually, that's a you know what? This is a good point. We got Seguino's got all this legislation. We should get something uh, against the Russians. Hmm. What if we do what the British did to the Australians? Take all the prisoners from the Russians, throw them on the island. Yeah, sounds like a good idea, actually. But the thing is, uh, I think that island became a better place to live. So I'm not sure that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be 100. Like, that as an option to extradite people for their holding over there, I think you'd get a lot less. If, mo if let's say, someone went away for, like, seven years or something like that, um, extraditing the highest criminals and putting over there and making it someone else's problem is probably not the worst idea. Honestly, I feel, I mean, do, does a terrorist come out after seven years or do the terrorists stay forever in jail? Uh, it just depends as far as what the sentence looks like. I ain't trying to have the same fucking cycle happen in seven years, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm with you. Um, I'm with you. He's, like, realistically, Soze, he's, I'm going to be shocked if he goes away for longer than uh, probably, I don't know, like, 10 years 
plus time serve right now as pending. Mm hmm. Okay. That's interesting. I thought the Senate might just fucking deport him. It's like not from America, right? So. Well, we did. Uh, so that was the original plan. Um, so I was working with Crane to offer a extradition. So given that there's a year and a half of investigative reports, it's actually, I don't know how that court case is going to be summarized in, in like even a reasonable amount of time. Uh, the original proposal was they look over the evidence, which all of which he's admitted to, by the way. Um, and he Wait, gets expedited. It's all. The, yeah, that's the crazy thing. I'm surprised well, he's in the trial. Oh, did the, did you, I mean, did you read his rights? What he said that? Is it recorded or? It's in his texts. It's actually crazy. Oh. Like, I mean, I, let me give you an example. He bombed a hospital. He bombed a police department. He bombed uh, the court center. And then he took a what, photo of it birthday? and, and I sent no, it to oh a my police God, I know officer. The, I'm such a bad and we have his DNA. Oh my God. And he's admitted to taking the photo. So like, I don't, I don't, like, I don't. He, but the thing is, I don't think he remembers he did any of this. But what we actually fuck? we actually documented each and everything with date and timestamp. So makes sense why he's denying everything taking the court. He's gonna put the board in proof on you guys to prove it instead of um, him taking a plea deal and being done with it. Mm -hmm. Which brings us to uh, okay. the, the talk we need to have us three. Remember that conversation we had a week ago? Well, I got Brian right here. Um. Not sure what exactly you um, want to tell him, but um, I do believe the sooner that we get with this, the better it will be, and we can take it slow and just. Um, you talking big. about the threesome we were offering? Well, huh? For uh, doing doing detective work. Correct. Oh. Wait, what? I'm fucking confused now. Why were you both surprised about that? I thought you oh. guys had already talked or something. Oh, no, I thought you were talking no. about White P there for a second. No, me and Brian have talked. We're just waiting for you. You're like the last trifecta. Right, right, right. Well, I mean, I'm still under the same uh, same shit I said last time. I want, uh, you know, someone someone to come in and run some detective shit and, you know, do the in-depth shit, not just the fucking bullshit that's, uh, you know, get, get raiding somebody because they cross a road or some shit like that. I want mm. people to investigate things, find the patterns, find who they're connected to. Well, you know, actual detective work, so... You know, uh, you've done that a lot, Brian. And if you're willing to uh, continue down that path, I don't think I want you in, a, in any sort of command role. I want you to, you know, well, it would be the the leading of the, the, the detective unit or detective certification, which would be run through mm. us in the state. If, if you'd be interested in doing something like that. I'm, uh, I'm very interested. I wanted to understand your vision because... Um, that way, when I do accept it, I'm adhering to the vision. Um, I mean, with anything, right? I, I want to make sure I, like, get it before, you know, taking on the responsibility. Um, okay, so this is, this is my vision. A fucking police investigative unit that doesn't make friends with fucking terrorists, okay? <laughs> they arrest them, and they do investigations. Damn, on like shots fired. Done. Holy shit. So you, pretty much. Uh, I'm a big proponent of, here's my current perspective, and, uh, I'd like to hear what your thoughts are. Um, I believe that every investigation starts, like, small. Uh, traffic uh -huh. stops inherently are investigations. Sure, yeah. If someone blasts yeah. you from a car, you shouldn't be crying that, oh my god, it was just a traffic stop. You should be asking the question, what was in the car that caused them to blast? And that the moment that that switch doesn't go in that direction, you are inherently not the doing. The stream is dark. Story. Yes, it's my mind. Exactly. You know, which it's, it's yeah. You know, that's that's the that's the basics of what I think needs to be investigated. You know, just because you do find somebody with uh, three guns or extra uh, uh, weed, do you have to fucking uh, put him in on the charges straight away, or can you see who he goes talks to? You know, find find yes. find different yeah. avenues, shit like mm -hmm. that. That's what I'm, that's what I'm talking about. Find the, the the bigger picture rather than just the one person. I'm, instead of, I'm instead very of pump much... and dump, more like um, keep on pumping. The good pump and dump here mm. and there's okay, as long as it's uh, you know somebody you hate just to piss them off. That's okay. Like yeah, it, mainly like more investigative. Fry, uh, like sure. Shit. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Absolutely. That's uh, okay. I'm we're we're on a similar page. My my one concern, and uh, you know, I had an example of this kind of prop up uh, earlier today. Um, my only concern is, uh, 
I, I'm going to be rather transparent here. I don't want to beat around the bush. Um, the, the current legal system that we have in Los Santos, uh, we have officers that simply don't understand some of the basics. Um, and I mean, those have even been around for a while, uh, especially during uh, the shift that I operate, which is 11 a.m. till about the time Bass wakes up. Um, sometimes, let's just say people like to big dick and question uh -huh. things and show their ignorance towards the law. My worry is uh, if investigations get compromised by ignorance. Um, and a higher ranking officer example, who's got no idea what's going on. Yes. Well, that's why I wanted to be a part of the state police. That's what me and you were here for. We, uh, we're the ones that will be uh, helping you run the department. So mm. we put you in as sergeant or something as a, as a trooper. And just in general, I think people will start to respect you more. And if there is an, oh, is an issue with shit. Uh, sergeant detective, damn. trying to outweigh you in investigative tasks, then Holy we will shit. step in because... We'll be we'll be a part of that unit ourselves if that makes sense. But we'll, you'll technically run it, but we'll be there as the you we're know your own chain of command, basically. The, we're trying to say, yeah, we're we're there, we're there to you know put people in line if we need to. Um, Do you be working for us, not for them? Okay. Um, so just a few more questions. I generally like to aim for plea deals. If uh, the crime, if I believe it's a building block to a bigger case, or we do not have the investigative prosecutorial uh resources is uh this is how we've gotten actually i think i myself have written about 20 plea no actually more than that maybe tw between 20 and 30 plea deals within the last uh year including that uh the hydra you know one where we got i think 12 pleas out of chang gang and what hydra, did say? saving us both resources investigative time in other words trial is not necessarily the objective or rather justice based on the resources yeah. we have is that is that something day, yeah. that's no that's that's mm -hmm. fine i don't give a fuck if people are getting prosecuted do it do it whichever way you want the 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 quicker the better it's it's all fine with me whatever happens uh like i said then, as long as the uh as long as the mentality's there to you know uh do in-depth investigations that's 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 the aim i also sometimes will let people go if they think that there's a bigger uh thing that if there's a bigger set of charges, I don't mind letting people go as long is that as it's not that stole a goddamn ambulance? detrimental. We have yeah, 60 like days I said, to press uh, charges. I don't like know, flimsy I don't, charges. Exactly. You know, if you uh, like I said, if you find someone with weed and shit, you can just play it off and uh, to do whatever it takes. Uh, that that that's that's the entire idea. You will have control to do whatever you want. Doesn't matter if you release people. You know, as long as long as the end thought is more more investigative things will come from it. That's what we want to do. Oh, if you need to, okay. if you need to do that, do it. I would ideally like to small, uh, what is start clear small, doing saying, up, 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 so up, up, up. that the vision that can be that... imparted on 40? the Who's new that? folks. So, oh, yeah, hundred percent. Things don't get out of hand, you know. You end up with like fifteen people. They start doing their own thing. Uh, now, all of a sudden, I'm playing babysitter instead of driving a direction. So what I'd suggest is try to get uh, one. This is what I've done for most of the search so far, and I haven't really had complaints coming back from them, is have one one or two people in each shift that are sort of mm -hmm. the real ones you trust. And then uh, also all these people will come through me too. So every everybody that gets added to any search still has to go through me uh, mm. uh, to, to be approved. But that, that's how I've been approving them. So if you get one or two in each uh, zone that's perfect, you know, get them trained up and then use them to train one or two, uh, you know, people afterwards. So the, the there's less, you know, work you have to do. You can get back to investigating and do your, you know, do do what you're good at. Hell yeah. Like I said, I, w I don't want you to be worried about doing command shit like you're in, uh, you know, when you're in high command and shit like that. Like you were mm. good at it, but I feel like, you know, doing investigative things is what we really need to get uh, tied up on. So absolutely look i'm here to do whatever is going to help the city so uh wherever you need me i'm uh, ready to go finally okay things are moving. This is it. This i'm good. fucking this down good. yeah How well, go, get, go, get your, uh, go get your trooper outfit on we'll, uh, <laughs> we, can, we can go do that shit now so am i a sergeant trooper am i understanding this correctly uh yeah we'll throw you a sergeant i think the only one there right now is uh what's his name uh, molten right yeah should you talk to libby yeah. and dark first brian 
Yeah, yeah. So go get trained and then send him an email and go. So yeah, listen, I got a better opportunity. Go fuck yourself or something like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> Be polite, Brian. I'm joking. <laughs> oh wait, what do I got here in my pocket? One second. His <laughs> Oh, look at this guy. Damn, you look fat in that vest. You should change the hair. You should probably change the hair. Let me, uh, let me, uh, let me, uh, you know what? I'll be right back. Yeah, I'm sure you can look better than that. Jesus Christ, I had a flashback from when he was fat. Yeah, me too. Uh, speaking of stories, actually, Air 1 is down bad right now in Shift 3. Have you taken a look at as far as Air 1 and, uh, K9? Uh, I haven't actually looked at it this week, so I can do it to, uh, tonight and see, see, see who we, uh, let through. So is it just, uh, Shift 3 that's struggling the most, did you yeah. say? Air one is down bad in shift three right now. There's only one or two pilots, and uh, they're not around often. Okay. So whenever there's a lot of boost or 37 alpha, uh, the meth run is happening. They don't got air one to help out. Yeah, with the yeah, yeah. I mean, shift three, I think, is always going to be our hardest to hit. So it might be worth just accepting just about anyone in that. Uh, I can, yeah, I mean, if you want me to tell Lovesick so. that, I'm just making sure that everything goes through you as far as search. Because I he, he wanted to approve well, people, but he's yeah, no, I him. still I still definitely want to look at it. But at the end of the day, if they're getting past the yellow, yellow coat shit, they're probably not that much of an issue to be in a uh, air cert. You know what I mean? Yeah, and I'm having... uh, either way, I'll look. I'll look at it tonight. So, All right, yeah, uh, we'll, we'll and Air One enough. is our biggest uh, struggle, and, and motor too. As well, some of the motors needs to be accepted for Shift Three. Okay. Also, um, with the canine shit, I'm not sure if we need to have one around all the time. I think it's sort of being random is also a good thing. You know what I mean? I don't disagree. Uh, I just know there's only it just might be. Uh, I think there's only like you... three right now, and they're not all in E Shift. So if we can have oh, at least yeah, one yeah. or I mean, two we, spare, we can get more. I'm just saying, like, you know, having one round all the time, I'd end up getting blowback from the criminals, you know, we'll start getting fucked Oh, a thousand percent. I mean, a thousand percent. Uh, having a K9 means they're going to run for sure every single time. Mm hmm So, at the end of the day, we want to reduce that sort of shit, so. Yeah, I mean, the way I see it is a special unit that comes out if needed, or depending on the calls or what's going on in the city, right? If there's a lot of drug calls, mm -hmm. maybe we can pull out the K9 as a counter to find ways to combat these calls. Yeah, I mean, if you see someone leaving a scene and, and, and you think that, I mean, Brian would, would be able to take use of it uh, a lot, you know what I mean? Having traffic stops when he's investigating someone leaving a warehouse or something, pull the dog up, you know, have a sniff, and they're fucked. Shit yep. like that. Yep. Uh, either way, yeah, I mean, uh, I'll, I'll look at the certs and we'll get some more signed off because I know we do need more, so. Perfect, I appreciate that, Commissioner. And then um, I'll email the Senate regarding the, the Russians and what's been going on.